Now, when people think about Israeli drone technology, it tends to be in the context of Israel striking military targets or defending itself from its enemies. But Israel trying to put a different spin on things, a world in which Israeli drone tech is used in the service of sustainability. Drone-filled skies, delivering life-saving medical supplies, surveying construction sites to make buildings safer, and even delivering some tasty treats to the park. It is not the future. It's the reality of the advanced drone ecosystem that Israeli officials showed off to ambassadors and business executives at a United Nations event last Wednesday. The potential of this emerging vertical goes even beyond the mitigation of climate change and other long-term goals. This technology is being used to save lives today. When disaster strikes and access to critical aid is a matter of life or death, thanks to drone, life-saving supplies can be mere minutes away. In fact, Israel is designing and producing drone tech that can also help the United Nations meet one of its primary goals, advancing sustainability, including reducing congestion on the road and emissions. Uh, we can see that there's a lot of growing interest in this, and we have many uh, delegations coming from all over the world to see how we're creating this new ecosystem. And uh, Israel is really becoming a lead uh, technological hub for the drone uh, uh, technology. The Israeli government is funding research and development for 16 companies, with many more using the so-called sandbox of infrastructure built through the initiative. This is a, a, a perfect platform that all together can discuss, brainstorm, synchronize, adapt each other about uh, what could be uh, uh, implemented, where, how, uh, to synchronize, as I said. And I think that this is the best stage for collaboration. But drone technology is still the Wild West in some ways, with regulators struggling to keep up with the rapid advancements. Israeli officials also met last week in New York with representatives of the U.S. Federal Aviation Authority and the Port Authority of New York and New Jersey to discuss safety challenges inherent in drones taking over the skies. In the meantime, though, Israel says it is critical to just keep flying. It's something that's hard to believe until you see with your own eyes. And as one of the companies answered in the end, what's the way to promote it is to fly. So we in Israel, we're, we're working on flying more and more, having more and more demonstrations, more and more companies, local and international, come fly with us, see the potential of this whole new ecosystem, and see how we can take it every day to the next phase. At the United Nations in New York City, Mike Wagenheim, I-24 News.